In this video, I will set up a camera schedule. I'll click on camera one to open the camera control panel. Now I'll click on the settings button. Now I click on the camera schedule toggle button to turn the camera schedule on. The camera schedule is an optional feature that really gives you a lot of flexibility in setting up your cameras to operate differently at different times of the day. So now that I have the schedule open, you can see a weekly schedule and four different colored profiles. Each color coded profile contains a group of camera settings. For example, if I click on profile one, the olive green color, I can see that the settings are one megapixel for the image format, five seconds for the delay between motion triggers, the motion sensor is set to high sensitivity, pictures per motion trigger is one, and the blinking LED is turned off. Now, since the entire weekly schedule is green, these settings from profile one will be used at all times. So now I'll go ahead and click on another profile. I'll click on profile two, which is the blue color. Let's say for example that there is a certain time during the day that I want the delay between motion triggers to be set to 30 seconds. So in profile two, I'll go in and I'll select the motion delay between triggers to be 30 seconds. Click done. I'll go ahead also and change the image format to one third megapixel. Now I can go to the calendar and drag my cursor over the times when I want this profile to take effect. Let's say for example Monday through Friday from 8 to 5. I'll go to the camera schedule. Monday 8 a.m. 5 p.m. Same thing for Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. So now if I look at the weekly calendar, I can see that on Monday through Friday from 8 to 5, the camera will use the settings from profile 2, the blue color. The rest of the time it will use the settings from profile 1, the olive green color. Now let's say there's another time when I want the camera to not take any pictures. I could click on profile 3, the pink color, and I could select motion sensor off. Click done. Now let me go on to the weekly schedule and select a time, let's say for example from sat on Saturday from 6 to 10. I can drag my cursor and there we have it. Now I can look at the weekly schedule and I can see on Saturday from 6 to 10 the camera will use the settings from profile 3, the pink color. And in those settings I see motion sensor is off. So during that time, the camera would not take any motion activated pictures. I can drag these profiles around wherever I want. Let's say there was another time I decided I wanted the uh, motion sensor to be disabled. I simply go to the calendar, pick the time, drag the cursor. Let's say I wanted to extend the blue time to another time period. I drag the cursor. I can even go to profile 4 and do another profile. I can have up to four different profiles. I can change my settings to whatever I want them to be. Let's say even video for example. Go to the camera schedule, drag it, and so during this time, Saturday from 1 a.m. to 6 a.m., 
for example. The camera would be using pro the settings from Profile 4, which are 30 second video. So when I'm done, I can click Update to send the settings to the camera. If at any time I want to go back and look at my schedule again, simply click on settings, go back, click on the colored profile tabs to open the settings for each particular profile. And I can see what settings the camera will be using at any particular time of the day.